Hey everyone, I am MSK, aka Master Swag King, coming at you guys today with a channel update video here today for you guys. So, first and foremost, I just want to say thank you to every single person who has been a subscriber of the channel and who has recently become a subscriber of the channel. Thank you for your continued support. It definitely means a lot. So, this is going to be one of those happy huge announcement channel update videos not one of those doom and gloom ones where you know like i would tell you guys a story of like i came home my wife is cheating on me and i saw the guy she was cheating with big fat cock slide up her tight pink pussy it's like no no not one of those channel update videos this is going to be one you guys are going to be super excited about and it's a channel update video that you guys can come back to you know, maybe in a couple of weeks and obviously, you know, a couple of years down the road and go, okay, this is what the channel ended up becoming. And I really, really enjoyed that. So like with my last channel update video, I'm going to be a little bit more clearer on what the content on this channel is going to be. Now, first and foremost, since this channel started as a League of Legends centric channel, actually, League of Legends content will always be a part of the channel, no matter what, any year any context no matter what so whether there's news regarding the competitive landscape for league of legends i will be doing videos on that then you also have the cloud nine podcast which is with me and uh, mr blanks and sometimes cole where obviously every single sunday it's 5 30 p.m pst or 6 p.m pst and if we can't do it sunday because either Chaz is too tired from locals in which he plays pokemon or i'm just too tired from work then we'll just do it that coming up Monday, which is literally just the next day, right? The Cloud9 podcast is currently about to end very soon. Uh, we'll be on season eight's 22nd episode coming up this week. And then after that week, we'll be on the season finale uh, for season eight. We'll be starting Cl the Cloud9 podcast season nine very, very soon. And thank you to every single person who has been watching that specific podcast for as long as you have. We're actually approaching... 200 episodes uh you know it's still a long ways away because we do only one episode a week but we are closing in on that milestone for this show actually and here's some good news about the cloud nine podcast as well that i do want to show you guys right here so i know people have asked me uh can you put this show on podcasting platforms such as like spotify and other places to obviously consume the podcast just in case you can't be in front of a you know a screen to watch and listen to the show you know so i have advertised this back when i had like the other channel and the other podcast that i was primarily on but here is where you will be getting the cloud nine podcast audio form i actually have a spotify for podcasters account where i can literally just upload uh, a podcast episode and it just distributes to all of the podcasting platforms okay so before i had the nightwing podcast on here and this is where i put the nightwing podcast episodes but i also realized to myself two things i didn't want to lose this podcast because i already lost two other podcasts i put in a lot of episodes for and i didn't want that to happen so i ended up renaming you know my account on here and i actually uh just titled it what I go by on the internet, which is obviously MSK, Master Swacking, as you guys know. The Iron Man podcast, which is the brand new podcast that I started doing, which covers everything that I love, which is like movies, TV shows, comic books, manga, video games, streaming, all that stuff, right? And then you also have the Cloud9 podcast. Currently right now, at the time of me recording this video, I am actually uploading all of the episodes of the cloud nine podcast and currently as you guys can see i am finishing up season two and then i will end up doing seasons three four five six seven eight all the way up to the point where new episodes will come out weekly for the show and then after i upload all the episodes of the cloud nine podcast all the first eight seasons then i will end up uploading all the episodes of the Iron Man podcast. So for any person out there that can't watch, obviously, directly on YouTube, Twitch, Twitter, you know, or Rumble, you can just obviously listen to it if you have a Spotify account. And if you have a Spotify account, please follow. Or if you listen on the other platforms, 
thank you so much. Our biggest ones are actually going to be, you know, Audible, Spotify, and Pandora actually and amazon music is in there as well because people said well what about amazon music and google podcast don't worry we're on those two the only one we're not on it's like apple podcast but i don't have an iphone and um i try to make one and it just it's going to be too much of a hassle so the podcasting platforms that we're on is fine and i have discovered that sometimes you could just look for your podcast and you'll find it on the internet someplace because i found it it was in other little smaller you know platforms as well but yeah for the most part, the Cloud9 podcast will be on podcasting platforms, uh, and I'm just currently right now getting all of these seasons uploaded. By the time you watch this video, two weeks later on from now, given how YouTube's algorithm works, I'll have all the seasons uploaded at that point, and then I'll start working on, you know, the Iron Man podcast, which, which is probably will be starting to get done by next week. I'm hoping... I'm hoping I'm getting all this stuff done within about two weeks. That way you can get, you know, the newest episodes right to you right as they happen, right? Okay, so that's with the podcasting platforms. And another update is the content surrounding what I'm going to be doing outside of League of Legends stuff. So as you guys know, I love movies, TV shows, anime, streaming, video games, comic books, manga, all that stuff. I will have content based around all that stuff coming up now will, will that all be here no all of that content is just going to be pre-recorded the only th videos coming on here is just pre-recorded videos and the cloud nine podcast once a week that's it the pre-recorded videos will be based around all of the topics that i just brought up to you right then you have to factor in there's news related you know, top, uh, there's news centering all those topics, right? So you're going to get news related, you know, co uh, videos to all those topics, as well as another source of main content, which is Yu-Gi-Oh content as well. I've already been working on a lot of content. People just haven't seen it yet. That's the thing. You know, I am building up all this stuff here. Uh, Pokemon market watches. I did end up doing, I, pr I, I did them, but I'm going to end up doing them uh, with Chaz because Chaz likes that a lot. So I'm going to try and set up a day potentially where we can, you know, collab really quickly and do a Pokemon Market Watch once a week for you guys. I think you guys will really enjoy that, you know. As far as like movies and TV shows, what I'm going to end up doing is I did this on the other channel, which was um, doing them in projects. Because for me... I'm like a completionist kind of guy. I got to start from the beginning and work my way up to whatever's new is coming out. So I'll give you an example. So let's say Yu-Gi-Oh. We're going to do a big project based around Yu-Gi-Oh. Where I'm going to watch and review. Where I'm going to watch and review every single season of Yu-Gi-Oh. Right? So let's say Duel Monsters. Right? I'm reviewing Duel Monsters Season 1. Battle City. And then Season 3. And then Season 4. And then Season 5. And then whatever. After that, we do another series. We do Yu-Gi-Oh! GX. And then we do 5Ds. And then we do Zexel. And then we do uh arc v and then brains and then the newest Yu-Gi-Oh series as it's going you know not individual episodes individual seasons so like let's use the newest Yu-Gi-Oh for example like whatever that season it's on ends do we watch and review it right movies included in there as well all in order then after that move to another property that i like dragon ball z's next and we'll start with dragon ball then we'll watch and review all dragon ball seasons then dragon ball z then dragon ball uh, GT, then Dragon Ball Super, then, you know, just keeps going so forth and so forth and so forth. Movie franchises included the same way. And I know it's going to take a long time to do that stuff. I know it's going to take a long time. But that's the beauty of this is I feel like that's the best way for me to do content, you know? And I know a lot of people like it. I know a lot of people said they, how much they've enjoyed it. And it's better for me as a person because i like it and i prefer it that way i hate just putting out a movie review of like a 31st movie in the franchise when i haven't even given my opinion on the other 30 movies you know because my opinion very much so might differ on a lot of other movies right so like mcu dceu all that stuff you know um i know saw 10 is coming out very soon and given how this year has been we probably won't have a project for anything horror related you know but we'll try and get something going with horror related very very soon there's other mini little movies trilogies in there as well that could get mini little projects here and there's so like let's say we do a big movie project but we kind of want to 
scale it back down to like some smaller movies here and there. There's Rush Hour that could be done. There's the Equalizer. You know, Expendables 4 just came out, but I didn't want to watch Expendables 4 when I don't re really remember watching the other three Expendable movies, actually. You know, kind of want to just do things in order and get them in line. That way, when the newest stuff does come out, there's some anticipation and hype there because we've already been building up to it. You know, not just randomly throw out a movie review and it's just some movie that's like the 13th in the franchise. I just don't want to do that. You know, I'd rather just take the time and set up and then do it slowly and then build up toward that. That's just what I want to do, you know? And for the most part, that is pretty much it there. There's not really any huge drama that I got to talk about. Because for me, as you guys know, I don't really involve myself in all that stuff. I'm not going to sound up. I'm not going to sit up here and act like I'm perfectly innocent and everything. But I really just kind of stick to myself for the most part. And then for like podcasts, I'll just bring people on that I just enjoy their company. You know, I'm not really trying to have a podcast where it's like kind of weirdly combative, you know, because it's just not enjoyable for viewers to watch that. It's like viewers should be accustomed to watching people. Yeah, they're going to probably argue a little bit, but it's not hostile. It's not combative. It's in a joking, friendly manner. And we're still going to be cool at the end of the day. And that's what I really, really enjoy, actually, you know. So for me, that's kind of the vibe that I want for the podcast that I have, you know. I invite the people on. You have a set group of people. Generally, typically, it's how it goes. You know, could vary week to week, obviously. But then those are the people that you get to know and those people that you follow. And, you know, that's just kind of how it should be. You know, back in the day, I had a different way of running things, but I ended up just changing it because it wasn't a good model and it just wasn't a model that I thought was just good enough anymore. And, you know, it was one of those models you had and you're like, okay, at least I tried it and I, I and I can look at it and go, that's just not a good way for things to go. Um, also, comic book reviews are happening too. As you guys know, I love comic books. I, I just love the medium so much, despite all the the bad that Marvel and DC end up doing sometimes and other companies as well. I, like, hey, if you're an indie person, like I mentioned before, I'll get your book. You know, I'm not really the biggest campaign backer guy. I'll just be the first to admit that. Not because I don't want to do it, because it's just a lot of money initially up front. And it's not really about the money in the aspect that it's a lot of money. It's more like I'll naturally just forget I even back someone's book because it'll be months till you get your book potentially when they have a set release date. So I personally just prefer if you're any person, I'll just buy your stuff if it's already made. Do you have any physical copies? I'll get your shit, you know? But another thing I want to mention on here too is... I made these uh, posts on Twitter. I'm going to do these, obviously, you know, every single week, you know. And this, I think, is going to be greatly helpful for everyone. Like, I don't want to close off my podcast doors to anyone, obviously. I don't want that to ever be a thing, you know. So I've mentioned it right here. For anyone, it's my, always going to be my, my most pinned comment. I'm going to obviously change this, you know, the wording and stuff like that to obviously you got to work on the Twitter x algorithm you know so basically agrees like this anyone who is a part of the hashtag iron age who is an upcoming writer author comic book creator content creator or even just a fan of entertainment in general dm me and you can be a guest in the iron podcast and key in mind there keep in mind this very important concept right here i just put out even if you're just a fan that so people are like what does that mean even if you don't have a channel you don't have to have a channel you got a good mic come on and let's talk you know what i mean no matter if you disagree, who cares about that? Even if you're just a fan, come and talk. You know, let's have a conversation. You know, this has no, like, you're getting walled off. You know, that's how it is. You're never going to get walled off. That's how it works here. You know what I mean? Unless I strictly, literally do not like you and then you won't be on. No, that's the only way anyone would not be on. So I specifically do not like you and I don't think you're actually going to be productive to anything. I'm just not going to have you on. You know, because... I'm not trying to sit there for an hour and it's going to be an insufferable conversation with someone. It's just not really something I'm trying to do, you know? So I'm also going to be going back to the movie theaters. And, you know, as you guys know, I do a lot of one-on-one -on -one podcasts now. And so there might be some days where you're not going to have a one-on-one -on -one podcast, but you'll at least have a League of Legends live stream. So I, where's my phone at? Oh, my phone's over there. I wrote down this stuff as well, you know? So I'm gonna put this on my other notepad over here that I have, because I'm a firm believer in just writing stuff down, you know, that way you don't forget 
I kind of think. So the biggest games we're going to play, obviously, on Twitch is League of Legends and Yu-Gi-Oh! Master Duel. And there's other games that I'm going to end up playing, like Fortnite I downloaded, the new Pokemon TCG Live. I want to start playing that. Huge fan of Pokemon. I love Pokemon, obviously. And that's and then the watch parties will also be on uh, Twitch and Twitter and uh, Rumble as well, you know? So, yeah, that's pretty much it for the most part. And the reason why I actually haven't been able to upload a video recently, not because I didn't want to. I love uploading pre-recorded videos. Um, I'm a better person at doing this than doing podcasts. I never did podcast alone. I'll never want to do them alone because I'm just not that interesting of a person to have on a podcast alone. I'm just not, you know. I'm someone where, you know, I am a person where I think I'm more stronger on a podcast with other people but myself. This I'm stronger with, right? So for me, you know, I want that to be what you guys can see the best stuff here, you know, I'm, and I'm only going to be producing the best quality content that I can because this is what I'm definitely strong at, right? So I want to get you guys. So, man, someone's te texting me right now. Ugh, good Lord. Good Lord. It's always when you're busy, right? Let me go to my notepad really quickly and check out what I wanted to tell you guys. All right. So. Let's say there's a Thursday where I, I got to go watch a new movie. And the reason why it has to be Thursday specifically is because I can't make the movie theaters any other day except for maybe Tuesdays and Thursdays. It's the only days I can go to the movie theater, right? So on Tuesdays, I usually have one-on-one -on -one podcasts. And, well, there's going to be weeks where I don't have that too. So keep this in mind. This is two different ways we got to talk about this stuff, right? So there's going to be, you know, some weeks where I go to the movie theater instead of having a one-on-one -on -one show. Now, that would only primarily be on Tuesdays and Thursdays, right? So if there's a new, new, a new movie coming out and I couldn't make it Thursday, I'm going to go that Tuesday because I want to get the review done, whether it be a live stream version of it with someone or it's going to be obviously, you know, a way we can talk about it, right? But it's only going to be Tuesday, Thursday because those are the only days I can realistically make it, you know? So if you don't see... Iron Man podcast episodes those days, even if they're just one-on-ones, you'll at least get a League of Legends live stream. And then, you know, if you don't, also the panel streams. Panel streams are mostly going to be on Monday. Some And Monday, I can get together a panel anyway. Mondays, Tuesdays, and Saturdays. The other days are usually just the solo one-on-one -on -one days, you know, but once in a while, sometimes Friday will have a panel day. And, you know, just, it doesn't necessarily change. It just, certain days... It's going to get offered and presented differently based on the situation I'm given. Because, you know, with one-on-one -on -one people, I got to set up the guests. We got to set up the time zones and all that stuff. It's a lot that goes on into the one-on-one -on -one shows. And then sometimes people come on, their mics are not good, and we have to scrap the whole thing. And it just happens sometimes, you know? But that's kind of just the most of all the con all, all the ideas and I uh, big announcements I wanted to say to you guys here. I have a whole load and list of just content here that I still need to do for you guys. You know, I, I wrote down this giant list of stuff that I even want myself, like personally, like, like, like certain jerseys, like eSport jerseys I want, you know, because I like to write stuff down and writing stuff down, I can go like, okay, this is what I want, this is what I want. And I have this for so many different videos right now. So many videos I'm trying to do for you guys, you know, trying to get back on that video grind actually, you know, and if news is kind of late, for me, that doesn't mean I'm not going to talk about it. It's just going to be a little late. And sometimes being a late is fine on certain things, certain topics, because I can fully flesh out my thoughts on something rather than, you know, just getting it out there instantly. That's what a lot of people do. I've also also write down what kind of comic characters I'm going to buy their issues for, um, you know. And what's the last thing I want to mention to you guys? I think that's pretty... Oh, the Cloud9 podcast will end up being on Rumble at some point. Just won't be any time in the future because I'm so focused on getting it right now up on the podcasting platforms. And when you upload videos to Rumble, it takes a little bit of time, actually. So it's going to be another thing I just dedicate time to. But I do want my podcast to be safe where I can make sure it's there. And I obviously have the episodes and access to them, you know. And even if you aren't subscribed to me on YouTube and you're just here from Rumble, right? On Rumble, I will be uploading this. this the same videos you see on the YouTube channel will also be on uh, Rumble as well. So, yeah, that's pretty much it. I just want to say thank you to every single person who's, you know, been here with me and who's, 
going to be here, obviously, with me in the future. And the other thing I want to mention right before uh, we leave is if you are on YouTube right now, because everyone's like, what's the YouTube channel? Well, this is the YouTube channel right here. This is the YouTube channel, Online Cinema Entertainment. And right here in the newest Cloud9 podcast episode, I ended up uh, putting everything all structured, you know? Oh, I do have a coffee bean coffee uh, affiliate ship with the quartering. I'll be adding that very soon. It's not here yet because I have to fix my password on his website. But other than that, I can put it here. Uh, but right here, TCG player, you can buy cards there, support. If you, I, I, we, we don't have a YouTube channel join button right now. So if you want to support there, you can have there's Patreon. There's your social medias right there. The, there's a, the bigger podcaster. These are the podcasting choices that we're the biggest on, you know? But that doesn't mean we're not any other place as well. So if you have like an iHeartRadio or a Stitcher, we're definitely there as well. The YouTube, Rumble, Twitch, and then you could have all the links right there with the link tree. So there you go. And that's going to be the same description for every single video unless I add in one of those affiliate chips that I might end up putting in there. So, yeah, thank you guys for watching so much. Like, comment, and subscribe. Most of all, enjoy. I am MSK, and this is Online Cinema Entertainment, your one place for online cinema. And we'll see you guys later. Peace. Deuces.